A man was in a supermarket once and he sees a beautiful woman and he approaches her and he says to her that I've lost my wife in the supermarket. Can I talk to you for a moment? And she says, why? And he says, because every time I talk to a beautiful woman, she appears out of nowhere. Obviously, this is a joke. But the point here is that as men, as husbands, we should get satisfaction from communicating with our spouses, right? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made our spouses a means of peace for us. And this applies both ways. When husband and wife communicate, they should ensure that generally their communication is positive, is good communication. And inshallah, we will be discussing what exactly constitutes good communication. And all with that, of course, there will be certain times in life where you need to discuss a certain issue, a certain problem. However, when you are doing that and you set aside a time for that, then discuss that issue and leave it at that. Do not let other issues creep into your communication at all times so that whenever you communicate, it just becomes something negative. It just becomes like, oh my God, we're going to speak now and it's going to be something wrong that I've done. So we need to try to make sure that our communication is good and our communication is generally positive.